I have you here. I'm going to be showing you a tutorial for the new features on the Gateway cartridge for 3DS. First of all, you need to download it, go to this website, and you can download the Gateway Ultra 3.71 Beta Public. Once you download it and extract it, you'll be have something like this there is a quick guide there for installing the software on your SD cards quick and easy blue card that all that goes on your blue gateway cards that's your launcher to go on your SD card inside your 3DS and I'll be showing you the new features cheats and everything and how to use them with your blue gateway card inserted with the files put on your SD card launch it Go to NVMAM installer. Hit the continue. Select which 3DS you've got. Mine's classic. And I am in Europe. Bam! You could go. it off take the blue gateway out the gateway with your ROMs on put the card in If you put it in the right way, power your system on. And you should know how to launch in the gateway mode. Go settings. Go to settings. Profile. Nintendo DS profile. Gateway. And it'll launch. Right, once you've got your 3DS set up and gateway set up and you've got some ROMs on your SD card. Go set system settings. Other settings. Profile. Nintendo DS profile. And your gateway should launch. Just like that. Press select, a list of ROMs will come up, 
if you press up then you get this screen you want to go down I usually use start and select press here then press start and select then go back now let's see uh, you want to find cheats for just the new Super Mario or I will choose New Super Mario. New Super Mario Brothers 2! Launch it. Again. As you can see, I've already hacked this one. The top one's got 257 lives. So I'll use this one that's got five lives. Just to show you. Go to the first level. Remember, you've got five lives, as it says there. Press start and select. As you can see, this screen comes on. Go to Treat Finder. We'll so have an 8 bit search. And you know we've got 5 lives, so choose 5. Press 8. It'll search the RAM for all locations that have the number 5 in it. Wait, the bar goes to the end. Then we can start the game again. Right, now go down to exit. Continue. And intentionally lose a life. Oh no! As you can see, we've got four lives now. Now repeat the process. Cheat finder. Next search. Exact value. Four. You can now view the hits. How many hits is there? Oh, there's too many there. There's lots, so we'll go back, back, exit menu, loss of life again, now we've got three lives, trade finder, next search, exact value, three, view hits, We've got three there, so I wouldn't change those. Three's all right. So change it to FF. That's what I usually do. Go back. Next one. F. F. Back. Next one. F. Back, exit menu. How much when we lose a life? Oh, we've got 255 lives. And it's simple as that to cheat. Just to prove it, I lost a life and I should have 254. As you can see in the top, 254 lives. To find energy, if there's if there's not a number, it is a bit harder to find. You have to go to Tree Finder, Reset Search. 
got a cheek finder <laughs> then I just have a look f through the entire game. Just say you lost a bit of energy, you will go back in, you will go to the next search, and you will go, you've lost some energy, so you go less than, and then it would search, then lose a bit more energy, then less than, then if you died, your energy will go back up to full, so you put more than, and it's just, keep doing it until, the hits are down to a couple and then you should find your health. 